The steel erection process began six weeks ago, and now more than 500 of the 2,500 total pieces of steel have been installed, as crews average between 25 and 30 pieces per day. In the initial weeks of this phase, Project Superintendent Brandon Valdez says the west end of the stadium has been the crew's main focus. The west building will be our critical path throughout the, the, whole, the whole project, just because there's so, much, so many more levels on that and so much uh, interior finishes on that. Once, we, once you get the building erected, your next push is to get it dried in. Once you get it dried in, the race is to get it finished out. And then that, that's when you're crossing the finish line at the end of the day. But crossing that line has been a challenge over the past few weeks. Although Mother Nature has not cooperated, crews have shifted their focus elsewhere. Well, what we're doing is we're working longer days, Saturdays, and some Sundays to make up the schedule for that. Uh, a lot of times we push through the weather as much as possible, but safety is a, a key thing, a key uh, ingredient to that. And if it uh, lends to unsafe conditions and we, that we don't do that particular work. Valdez says that even though the weather has been the biggest obstacle, the crew has found ways to make up for lost time by putting their efforts towards completing other aspects of the project, such as pouring the foundation and excavation for the footings.